and we are in the garden right now of Mike Prager and many of you recognize him as a staff writer with the Spokes and Review. Mike, your garden is going to be on the tour on August 9th for the Associated Garden Club tour and you have some of the most beautiful evergreens and they are growing so well in your garden. Can you kind of walk us through some of these? Okay, let's do that. Okay. Now what have we got here? Let's start right here in this okay. nice bed. Uh, down below we've got a, a, a type of cedar that grows um, in Asia and it's um, uh, the cedar and then we've got two types of fir here and both of them, including the blue one in back, are from the uh, southern Rockies. That blue looks like a spruce. You're saying that's fir. Yes, that's a fir. And it's closely <laughs> related to our native noble fir here that grows at a higher oh, elevation. beautiful. And of course... Oh, this is a, a <laughs> weeping larch. And it, of course, is deciduous like all our larches in this climate. But that's the eastern larch. Gorgeous. Let's take a look at a few others. Well, now, Phyllis, one of my favorite plants is the false cypress, the Honoki cypress. They come in all different number of different sizes and shapes. This one is very, it's been here for about six or seven years and it's got such a unique shape that I just love it. Now it's closely related to the one with the gold variegation on it on the outside that's a little taller version of the same type of plant. Phyllis, here's another example of the false cypress that I really like with the yellow variegation and I like it especially up against the uh, burgundy purple of that shrub. Um, in the backyard, I've got another one of the um, Middle Eastern cedars that uh, is a very kind of bluish white that's called Snow Sprite that we'll take a look at. Well, Phyllis, here's one more I've got to show you. This is a spruce. It's called Papoose, and it stays small like this for a long time. I'm telling you, folks, if you want to see some beautiful evergreens, you need to come and visit the Associated Garden Club tour August 9th. Thank you, Mike. Beautiful garden.